Just to give you a little size comparison of our sack. Well, I think I was just going for the fact that if we send this to Matt Best and to them over at Free Range American, hey, Black Rifle for Coffee, free advertisement. I know, my two veterans. Mm. 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 And mm. Texas Home Company. Just saying, Black Rifle Coffee. Now that we're done sucking their dick, let's uh, see what's in the box, shall we? in the box. Thank you, Amazon. So. Like, I'm actually more afraid of the fact that while this is on my coffee table, I have to actually raise the camera up just to see what's inside the box. Well, so as many of you don't know, unless you follow us on Twitter and nobody follows us on Twitter, so nobody knows then, we won from Elegu themselves, the Mercury X bundle, which is the bigger version of the Mercury. So we thought, what better way to celebrate this win than getting a Saturn and a Neptune too. You know, all I'm saying is, do you realize that with Jeff Bezos going to uh, space this week and Neil Armstrong riding the Saturn, there's a lot of a space theme today. There is. And there's a lot of dick jokes, so just stay tuned, everybody. Well, we always stay tuned. Um, so the Neptune 2, of I, course, everybody knows, is Elgus filament printer. Very hard to been getting hold of. It, every time I found it and had money, it was sold out. Except for this time. I got lucky. Same with the Saturn. Every time I found it on sale, it was sold out. But I managed to snag both of these. Is my wife happy? She's happy about the Saturn, not so much about the Neptune. So, well, is the company happy? The company's very happy. The company, the company better be happy with as much of my own money I'm investing into it. <laughs> Big cut. Hey, Justin, it says fragile. Oh, great, it must be Italian. Well, let's start off with uh, what I'm actually very excited for. They damaged my box. The Saturn V. Oh wait, my bad. The Saturn. It, just so box. we can notice it, the box is damaged. So this is going to be a true unboxing and hopefully everything is... As my cat sister falls off the chair. So, nurse, scalpel. 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 Thank you, nurse. We make the first incision. Got to poke it a few times though. Okay, look, this thing has made mini Necrons and Space Wolves lately. It's a little dull. I can help. She's sure about mine. Or at least brought extra blades for it. Could, could let me know. I didn't realize it was that dull. It's not hardly dull, but it's dull enough. All right, so. <gasps> look, we have more terrain. Actually, I'm now kind of impressed because I thought that was part of the... No, no that's just a corner protector. This might good. be good. Still more terrain. By the way, our good friend Joe has brought us more terrain pieces as well. Well, I have some in the garage too, and actually really nice ones. We really need to sit down and make some terrain one day. It's the best thing about it. I mean, I've started. I actually need to pour the resin for the new Holy crow! <laughs> oh my god. Uh, I'm just saying, we need to sit there and have a stick, a stencil made of just a five. Say no more. Oh, I know. Because, I mean... I've got my wife printing stuff today as we speak. I am that nerd. No. We got from Amazon. There's, no. a, there's only one appropriate stencil to go up here. Schrodinger's cat? Schrodinger's back in the box. Okay. Ooh. Toolkit! Hence why I didn't bring any tools with me. 
Why? Because they send me everything I need. The fact that we, we get a Harbor Freight spatula that's actually pretty nice. Look at that Allen key. Allen keys, screws, instructions. <laughs> I got skills. That Oh, I wish I would have got that on video. Yes, he did just overhand shoot it into the trash can. From my back. With blind. Ooh, new snips. New snips. And everybody wonders why I have so many snips. It's because I get one in every render. So this is set like number six or seven now. Yay! New snips. There you go. Uh, power cord. Our COVID mask. Straight from China, so. Probably more COVID. Yeah. We're gonna find out. Maybe it's the Echo variant. I mean, we're already on the Delta. Yeah, I see, so I'm hoping to start a new trend, get the Echo. Just not the Dolphin. And USB drive, which will have the test print on it. But we're not doing that test print. Because today, with this, we're gonna see how big of a benchy I can make. I'm still saying we need to do a benchy prime. No. You know what's benchy I'm talking about. Oh, I know. Oh, my lord. <laughs> Are you going to pull it out of the box? I am going to pull it out of the box. All freaking 60 pounds of it. Oh, God. <laughs> Go away, box. So now one thing I am going to end up doing on this printer that I've learned from Uncle Jesse and from my own stupid mistakes is I'm going to put handles on the side of this cover mm -hmm. because the Mars 2 without the handles is now looking raggedy and it's not because it's damaged or anything it's just it's dirty and Schrodinger stop biting the box. Oh, almost fast for papers. Okay. We're gonna go a little easier with this. So, have we ever discovered if they actually made this so we can hook it up to a network yet? Yes, they have. Is it updated finally? Yes. Okay, cool, because I know not too long ago, they're like, we've got it, but we can't do anything with it. Sweet. So, another secret that's coming out of the bag, besides the Saturn, is I ordered a Raspberry Pi so I can start doing Octo prints. So, soon be, soon both the Ender 3 and the Neptune here will be on a network with cameras that I will control from anywhere I go. So you're saying that the shop's gonna get a security system? The shop is getting a security system. Oh, secret agent man. And the good thing is, is we already have a security guy for network security. There we go, since I know you want to hold it and play with it. Oh my god, what a space cadet. The fact that uh, we can literally print my head. And have room to spare. Do we do we call you a board now? Ooh. I mean. Uh, yeah, take that out there. I did I did the Mars too. Oh, oh, there it is. <laughs> Don't pull an Uncle Jesse and drop it, please. Nope, but I'm just more happy for more terrain pieces. I'm happy for more terrain, but I'm happy the fact that I can print some big terrain now, too. Oh, my lord. You know what it doesn't come with, though, that I really need to buy now? The flex pipe. Bum flex seal. 
so flex plate will be coming for this but with what we've learned with the mars 2 we can print with this today and it won't be so bad dude Yeah, we're not ready to remove that it says stuff yet. No, but like that is hefty. It's an actual metal? Yes. Cool, so that was one of the big upgrades we did with the Mars 2 is we went through and changed out the plastic reservoir that it came with. Now don't put them back in there. Oh, I'm not, I'm just. <laughs> My good sir, we've got to level this thing. Oh, I know. Which means we're gonna need computer paper. Dunk. And we need to plug this in. We don't have any resin though. Oh! What's in the bag? <laughs> What's in the bag, he asked. I will say I do like it. it has the little handles on it yeah and I like the fact that there's recess points in it so if, if I didn't know any better I'd certainly say that was magnetic it's not though I know it's not but it, the fact that it goes in and it homes perfectly print now yay so with that being said we're gonna move the Saturn out of the way for right now and unbox the Neptune so uh are we gonna talk about you digging through the trash are we gonna talk about how you can't get the plate on you couldn't get the plate on either I got I seem to have got the plate on my good sir after you read the instructions now let's see the real mystery here do I remember how to zero these machines? This. Look at that massive display. Look how slow it is. Jeez. I love it. Well, we also have the other one on the warp speed. Let's see how close it is. Well, it's it's actually fairly close to being able to level right out of the box. Yeah, it's not horrible. But that being said, that is not the perfect way to level it either. So let's go ahead and take it back up. Watch the extruder wobble. The screw. Weevil wobble, weevil wobble, weevil wobble. You can weevil, you can wobble, but you can't fall out. Which, by the way, huh. one of my favorite cadences. We only say you can get it about the pregnant women. Exactly. All right. And as I sit there and I mention this, my battle buddy, you know who you are. Just remember, if you can weeble, you can wobble, but you can't fall down. Uh. I will say this is the only thing I don't quite like about this. Mm -hmm. So we've got the paper that goes under it to test where our actual zero is. 
Mm-hmm. How much can you tell where the screen is? For the shift this way. You really can't. So. The good thing is though, with it being set here, and now set here. So, now we, I am literally taking it up 0.10. I hit set zero and zero is now set. So now we can go back in, put this thing back up. I think I had to do a lot more on the Mars 2 for setup. Mm -hmm. Go ahead and remove this sweet sweet film and then you saw the one on the top sheet yep a little stack with it not bad 